Hey guys, it is Who Do You Think 100. Before I say anything, we've got a cinematic. I'll let you watch this. Why we always gotta listen to this shit for anyway? Cause I'm in charge, that's why. Oh, it don't seem like no good kind of reason to be awesome anyway. Hey, what's that? Hold on a minute, let's take it. Looks like you mashed some poor feather's dog, Sarge. It's a Zerglin, Lester. Smaller type of Zerg. But he can be out this far unless... Oh, shit. I love you, Sarge. So th this just shows that the Zerg are invading the planet of Marsara if you haven't gotten the storyline so oh yeah briefing receiving incoming transmission calmly, calmly established. established I got your message magistrate and frankly I don't care what you have to say about confederate regulations you damn fringe world yokels are all alike don't know where your loyalties lie y'all have a real good day now you hear Transmission ended. The report you requested is ready. Sixteen outland stations have reported sightings of the alien invaders identified as Zerg. The Confederates have arrested all standing militia forces and continue to avoid action against the Zerg. Three stations have fallen to the Zerg already. We've been unable to locate any source of military relief except the extremist faction known as the Sons of Korhal. Their liaison is holding online. Good day, Magistrate. My name is Arcturus Mengsk, and I represent the Sons of Korhal. You're familiar with the Confederate propaganda surrounding my group, but your reputation suggests you'll see past it. It's never been our practice to operate in any one place for long, but these Zerg don't look like they're going to wait. I'm going to make you an offer, Magistrate. I'd like to help you out by sending down a number of transports to your colony and evacuating any survivors. You know, of course, that my organization operates outside the bounds of Confederate law. That's why they spread their lies and misinformation. If you decide to accept our help, you'll be branded as an outlaw, too. But it's a chance, it's a chance to, to save these people. Time to make a stand, Magistrate. Ending transmission. Ending transmission. Priority, Priority alert. alert. Evacuation zone under attack by Zerg forces. Distress beacon activated at 1220. <clears throat> so, what this mission is, it's a uh, wait out. This thing's on fire! You ought to send an SCV out here to repair it. You can fix my bike up too while he's at it. Go, go, go! So, this is just a wait out mission. Wait out for 30 minutes. But the game time for every five seconds, for every six game seconds, for every six seconds, it for every five real seconds, it's six game seconds. So that's how I'm describing it. So I have to actually record this twice. The first time I forgot to add uh, the video, so uh, the second part I had some guest people with me. They were uh, Warrior Wear Failures, Bumpy the Dog, and SMRPG. So at about minute 22, I'll stop the recording. You guys will uh, hear them instead of me. 
and the layout of my base will be a little bit different. I might have some upgrades that I don't have now. But that's what's gonna happen soon. So like it's already been two minutes. It hasn't really been two minutes in life in real life. But this is a pretty easy mission. You don't do much. If you're a new person and this is the first time you've played this, it might be a little bit difficult, but not really. So supply depot. What I like to do is always be making SCVs. Like, no, no matter what, I want to be making an SCV. I have some fortress here that are our new no unit. Problem. 80 health, no armor, yeah, 20 going. damage. Missile turrets, 200 health, 20 damage, but these yeah. only attack air. Yeah. Uh, vultures yeah, only attack yeah. ground. Right away, sir. Uh, yeah, so, making a refinery. On your mind. Some zerglings died. So I can just I send did. some vultures out if I want oh. to. Is that it? Yeah, I'm just sending them to the end. So there's two ways to do this mission. You can either like kill the Zerg, like go around the map and kill their bases and kill all their buildings. Like here's some creep that means that the Zerg's here. Uh, up here, there's a base, a sunken colony, it's a different unit, I'll explain that later. But what I'm trying to get to is all the way up here. Here it is. The Zerg's main unit, the hatchery. Uh, I'll explain that when we get to the Zerg campaign, or somewhere near there. Insufficient gas. Let's make some of these guys. So, like you can come up here and kill their base, but that takes a considerable amount of force. What I like to do is I just defend. I straight up defend. Like I have units in these bunkers. What the bunkers do is they hold the units so that the units inside can't die until the bunker does. as 350 max health. And here's the new thing that an SC, you learn what an SCV can do. Like, of course the bunker has a limited amount of health, so you can repair it, and it goes back up. This is a Terran only feature, the other races can't do it. So as you can see, I'm already getting some high amount of minerals, and I'm nearing my own time limit. So, uh, that's basically what happened. I messed up. I don't have video, but I do have the audio. So you'll hear. So you'll like, it's complicated. I don't know how to explain it. Yeah, but yeah, my base layout will be a little bit different. My units. But what I want to say real fast is what I like to do. Three bunkers. And the back one has four marines. And the front two have uh, three marines and a fire bat. So I'll see you guys in just a second.